How's it going, Pokemon trainers? This is Trainer Corner, and it's time for a Wi-Fi battle video here on Showdown. Once again, make sure you hit that like button and subscribe if you enjoy this video. And uh, make sure you look out for more Showdown battles and other Wi-Fi battle videos for your viewing leisure. Just, just keep an eye out. Now, in this particular battle video, you see I have a new team with a little bit of Pokemon that you've seen me use before, such as Lycanroc, Vikavolt, uh, and Greninja. Ash Greninja. So you see over here with my mouse, you see this, these are our teams. I have Zygarde, Greninja, Talonflame, Metagross, Vikavolt, and Lycanroc. My opponent, Cool Guy Gus, has Caesar, Gyarados, Magirna, Garchomp, Capulini, and Formosa. So we've got a, a quite an interesting team to face here. We've got potentially a Mega Caesar, a Mega Gyarados, maybe, I'm not really sure. Uh, Magirna is a legendary Pokemon, sort of, I don't know. Uh, Garchomp can go Mega. And uh, Capulini is a Guardian. Formosa is a Ultra Beast. We got quite some Pokemon here. Uh, but I do want to try out Zygarde. I was going to try out Zygarde with the ability Power Construct, which makes it go into complete form, which is actually banned right now, so I can't use it. So we'll be using Zygarde regular form, or 50% form. So, this will be interesting. Um, I am using Greninja again because it proved to be a really good Pokemon in my other match. If you haven't seen it yet, make sure you do so. Uh, Talonflame is just an overall great Pokemon to have on any team. Metagross, I have it Mega. That will be fun. Vigavolt is uh, Choice Specs. It's really good. And Lycanroc. So let's go ahead and play this thing. I will stop to make note of certain plays as usual. And uh, without further ado, let's go ahead and play this thing. So I'm going to start with Town Flame, and my opponent is going to start out with Feromosa, which is actually my first time using, or uh, facing it rather. I don't know what type it is, but he withdraws. And he goes to the guard shop, probably expecting a Flare Blitz or something, but I actually go with the Will O Wisp. So we burn Garchomp, which is fantastic. I wasn't hoping, like, if, if he was going to use Stone Edge, I was hoping it wouldn't kill. But he, you know, he barely gets to kill me there, uh, which is a little unfortunate because I went for the bulk up to raise up my attack and defense. Hoping I can roost at any point. Uh, I do not have Gale Wings here. I have Flame Body. So there goes my chance of using Talon Flame. I go into Vicavolt expecting like another Stone Edge. I can probably take it because he's burned. His attacking power is cut in half. He goes for a Dragon Claw, which is fine by me. Here we get to see how much a Stone Edge does to Vicavolt. And we can just finish off Garchomp with a hidden power ice. Next up, he has Gyarados. And I was like, well, it's confusing right now because I don't think he knows what item I'm using at the moment. But I do reveal that I am choice in some way, as I would have taken him out right away with a Thunderbolt, but I am locked in on hidden power ice. So yes, you see, he just, he goes for the substitute. That's what happens here. He knows I'm choice specs. So that's unfortunate. He goes for the sub and dragon dance. That's a nice strategy there. Uh, I am going to go for the extreme speed. It is appropriate just because he's faster than me. But we see a plus one waterfall doesn't get the job done. He goes for another dragon dance, which I... You know, I go for the Outrage. So had he went for the Waterfall again, he could have had a chance to flinch me. But, you know, that's a roll. That's a roll whether I would get flinched or not. So we take out Gyarados with no issues. That's two Pokemon now. Now we have to face Tapu Lili, which is one of the Guardians of Alola. And uh, it's a Fairy-type. So Moonblast. I could have switched out into something, but... 
like my Megos, for example, but I didn't really feel safe in doing that for some reason. I really regret it now. Uh, because I make a stupid play, I go into Green Ninja, hoping to outspeed Capu Lili, and then it fails. It fails. So now's a good time to go into Megacross and Mega Evolve, go for the, the Mega Evolution, and go for the Bullet Punch, because I thought it would work. However, Psychic Terrain makes it so that Bullet Punch and other uh, priority moves will not work against the opponent. So I go for Earthquake, trying to put some damage onto the Caesar who goes Mega and goes for the Swords Dance. I just go for another Earthquake. I get a critical hit, but it just doesn't quite cut it, obviously. Goes for the Pursuit here at plus two. He was thinking I would switch, but I didn't switch, so that did not kill me. But he has Bullet Punch of his own and finishes me off. That means that my uh, Town Flame, who, you know, Brave Bird with Gale Wings, I would have probably taken him out. Maybe, I'm not really sure. But I have a Flame Body instead. I don't get the burn on that, unfortunately. I do have a Focus Sash on Lycanroc. Which kind of saves me there. I don't know if I should have done that initially, but... We do see I outspeed Mega Caesar when I go for the Stellar Rock. Which I thought was interesting. I didn't really think on outspeeding a Mega like that had I done that initially. These plays I'm making here, they're making, like... I should have done, like, a long time ago, but I just didn't do it. And here we see just exactly how priority just doesn't work against psychic terrain as a solar rock fails to hit. And that means my last Pokemon, Vicavolt, it's going to go down as well. So we, we had a tough time with Kapu Lili in this entire battle, and we don't see Moderna as well. So, you know, we, these mistakes happen. I realize that it's a new generation, you're trying to learn stuff, and that's what's happening here. But it was a great uh, battle to pass it up, you know? So I hope you guys enjoyed that, and uh, there will be another battle here soon, so look forward to that. If you guys enjoyed the match, make sure you like the video, subscribe, and I will see you next time. Goodbye, trainers.